Hello, welcome. Welcome back. You're at Reaction Talk. I'm Angie. Rowan. And we got a little special something something here. This comes out of the comment requests. Um, Adrian brought this, and I think he might be the winner of new artists brought to the channel. But this is voice play. Okay. And nothing else matters. So there's history to this song. <laughs> So when I saw it, I was like, oh, yeah, no, we're doing that one. So when we were teens, Roland sold me the And Justice for All album by Metallica. I did. For five dollars. Mm -hmm. It was a good deal. That was a fabulous deal. Mm. It's almost <laughs> like I wanted something other than to sell you a record. Nope was strictly platonic purchase retail mm -hmm. yeah you, <laughs> it was at that time it was all just it was yeah i was just okay, a nice guy you were i didn't you were the cool I, no guy no shifty moves nope then after that i didn't know metallica before that and then i was like done i fell in love with metallica loved um you know couldn't get enough okay by the time the black album came out lots of people can attest to this during that time that there was a huge portion of the fans that said they had sold out and were kind of done. And some of them had left even after Cliff had died. And that was after Ride the Lightning, right? No. Um, Before Ride the no, Lightning? No, after. Uh, no, after. Ma um, Masters of Puppets. He Master died during that tour. During that tour on a bus. Yeah. In a bus. They were on a bus and they had a crash. Yeah. Uh, Cliff Burton, for anyone who doesn't player. know, was the former bass player. And anyway, so I still loved that. I actually really love that album. I have lots of memories associated with this album that makes it even better. And if you need context on that, you'd have to go back to our last reaction where we talked about uh, well, Motley Crue and that, which was the last one? Because it's about... Come on and dance. Yeah, was that the one we talked about? The experience? It's about experiences well, sure. of yeah. music and what's going on in your life at that time that makes music more appreciative when you remember it from, uh, you know, remembering the past from the future. So anyway, nothing else matters. Man, I love this song. And Mr. Roland don't like it. But that's okay, because we'll try to get him to like it. With voice play. It's not, you know, and it's not that there's anything wrong with the song, wrong with the band at this point in their career. I was just one of those guys that it died when Cliff died. Uh, the the cover albums, even though I find Garage Days to be an incredibly good album, uh, it just it, it wasn't the same. I actually branched out, and, and, and unfortunately and fortunately, it made me start listening to all the other thrash that existed. And it turns out most of my thrash didn't get on the radio. So it was a, a bittersweet win on my side, but uh, not one you want to celebrate. Yeah, so each to their own. Everybody, <coughs> we all like and dislike, whatever, right? Yeah. And we're allowed to do that. So I'll be open-minded. I was actually, I really, I wanted this, like, played it. If I had gotten married, I wanted it played at my wedding. Like, I loved this song. It just had this, you know deeper meaning and it's all subjective again personalized yeah. to whatever's going on to your life mm -hmm. at the time and how it fits in that puzzle so nothing bad or wrong about that you know yeah because if it was me i'd be like i love you but i hate this choice of music baby I no know. more i know i know all i'm right. mostly kidding all right let's see what they do so they have somebody with them though it looks featuring uh, jay nun jay nun do you know are you no familiar? clue so we don't know uh, that artist. So sorry, we uh, don't. No, we I'll wouldn't. put some info in the description box so that it'll all be there. If you need to know more, go down there, check it out. Uh, their their stuff will be linked in there too because we give shout out to everybody that comes in so that that you can go right to their page and you know find out more. So all right, let's see what they do. Roll it. All righty, let's go.
close no matter how far couldn't be much more from the heart forever trust in who we are and nothing else matters mm-hmm. never open myself this way life is ours we live it all way all these words i don't just say Ooh, and nothing else matters trust i seek and i find in you every day for us something skills I, I every time i hear i mean i've heard them a handful of times right mm-hmm. and every time i swear i'm like i haven't heard him go that long oh, yeah no. but i i know i have it's yeah. just like he does do it in this very uh, they've talked about it where some people can go that low but it doesn't sound good yeah you know what i mean uh, yeah yeah so it but yeah, they do. They are very, very, you know, distinct. Very good. Like, I guess that's part of the whole um, acapella, right? Yeah, you mean being uh, like. I think Voice I know. Play. Yeah, yeah, I think we've I know talked about it. Yeah. Uh, and if they do, I don't know. But I think I do. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, fair I enough. was lost in the lyrics, so I'm actually thinking about what the hell it might have meant at the turning point in their careers. And oh, I'm listening to these words. Interesting. Going, hmm. Gosh, I don't know if I, if I can like it worse than ever. I don't think I like the lyrics. I don't think I would have wanted to be married to them. No offense. Yeah, yeah. And because this is one exactly what you're talking about, and I mean, you mean everything to me. Yeah. But I would never bullshit you and go, oh. No, yeah, I know. no, this resonates so much. No, I mean, I you, I even said it. I mean, the, the song that I want is, is horrible. It's not even a good song. And it was used as like bad memories. And wow. It's like, but no, because we. But do you see how, uh, like, okay, think of us back in the 90s, girl fantasy, nothing else matters. It's yeah, all but I was this listening. lovey, lovey stuff that... they impose. Yeah, because we impose on there. We're projecting it onto the song because yeah. we're creating the song about what we want it to be about. Yeah, right? Maybe. You see what I'm saying? Sure. Because I'm, I'm listening saying. to the actual lyrics going, huh, I wonder if success is all that mattered and they didn't really like their fans and now that they can actually break free from being a jeans and t-shirt band to having everything they want, maybe they were envisioning, you know, walking out of Gucci's, you know, 20 years from now. Stop. Really? Well, they became a, a no, huge juggernaut know. of financial I success. No, I disagree. I disagree. <laughs> no, I don't know. I meant all my, all my opinions of her entertainment purposes only. I don't know nothing. It has nothing to do with this performance No, no, at all. we're just talking about Metallica's yeah, history. Yeah, 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 yeah. The lyrics of the song and... Um, this, this is very cool. Yeah, you know, and it's... Uh, I, I don't know. Like, so you think somebody else is going to come in, or is that in the background? I have no idea. Because I know that there's always, I thought there was always five. I Well, see, I don't know. Was uh, one guy swapped out for another guy? I have no clue because I don't know enough about the band. Right, okay. Well, then let us know. Let us know in the comments. Mm, Very little. Okay, Mm. let's go. Never care for what they do. So 
I I like the arrangement they did. Like it's not changed so much that you know, some people like it changed, right? Yeah. But I think I like how they did it. My that's oh. just me. Well that's very cool. Yeah. For the cover perspective, is super good. Yeah. And see, maybe a uh, voice play has a um, changing lineup, and maybe because, Where, because the uh, guy I never seen I a young lady maybe... in them, and there you're gonna. Yeah, because oh, well, maybe. Yeah, um, no, because that looks like them. But I thought maybe the guy with the grab the violin, but that was the guy. No, that's the, the beatboxing right? dude. Yeah. Okay. I thought, yeah, I see, know. and I, we, I don't know enough, don't so you, that you. is. Tell us in the comments. And um, Wes, Jay Nunn is one of the members, and it was, no, because they all sang parts, so I don't, no, I don't understand. I know, you guys help us out. Let Ange know, yeah. Angel let me know, and then we'll all be in the know. Yeah, there you go. And I, I hope, um, no disrespect, it's a, I don't know what it is. I'm going to go listen to, you have no idea what I want to listen to right now. I wonder if your guy... Leo has done this and uh, redone this at all. No? See, I, I would like to go hear um, actually a couple Metallica cover songs right now. And if I uh, listen to So What, uh, uh -huh. uh, I, I could pretty much forget about what, no offense, I find uh, nothing <laughs> else matters to be pretentious. And uh, I go and listen to a little So What and, and know that they, uh, they scrape the bottom of the barrel too. So I did do uh, Miley Cyrus covered this tune. There'll be a card in this video. So I did that one. She actually did it pretty good. She can sing very well. No, she actually did it with them. She sang with them. 
not by her. I don't think it was. But but they let her do. Yeah, but then they, they said what's the they they said. Uh, uh, what's uh, I don't know her name singing fuel. Give me fuel. Give me fire. And they thought it was great. Well, and, I don't um, know. It's all and each here, to they, their each own. Their own. I don't. Yep, it's all subjective, and I'm obviously a hater. If I like I, Miley singing it, I like Miley singing it. If I had right? to leave a comment, Metallica, thank you for the songs that I love, <laughs> and I'm sorry I don't appreciate all of them, and I'm sorry I mean to Lars. Love rolling. <laughs> all right. Very good voice play. That was awesome. Metallica's cover of Nothing Else Matters. I like it. And one day we'll, you know, meet halfway with Roland on Lars's band. No, we won't. Love you. <laughs> Later.